Okay. Hi. Hello. I'm here. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can. Okay. I said hi. Do you want to tell me what? Huh? I said hi too. I said hi three times. Oh. Okay, I didn't hear you. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> Are you in a bad mood? So what's going? I'm. I'm just in hurt. Why? But. but that couples counseling thing really pissed me off. We have to learn how to be co-parents. What better way than to have a professional help us with that? He's always going to be a part of my life with the kids. Yeah, I can't but... just shut him out. So we have to have a really strong relationship. It affects kids in a really negative way when their parents don't get along. They can sense that kind of stuff. There's a lot of tension. I understand that. I lived through that my whole life. When exactly. You said that. I, I thought you. I thought you were telling me that you were going to dump me and go back to him. Well, that's the problem. Is when you start thinking, you make up shit. Well, couples counseling. Oh, how, much, how much do you think I'm going to take out of that? All you had to do was ask. What does that mean? Well, I, I pretty much thought I got my answer when you say couples counsel and want my input. Right. Well, we're a why couple. would you ask your boyfriend to input on? I am asking your input. I want to know your input. That's really important to me, too. I just want you to understand that. He's always going to be a really important part of my life. There's nothing that I can do to avoid that. It's the same thing as if you had kids and their mother would have to be somebody really important. I understand that. I don't understand why you want me on him on the phone, too. Are you never going to speak to him? No, I probably will, but you know, with everything that's happened in the last 24 hours, the first time we actually get to talk on the phone wouldn't be the best time for it to have him on the phone, too. Okay. First time, the first time we talk on the phone since all this, in the last 24 hours, since all the stuff has happened. It's not the best time to put him on the phone, too. Okay. You're absolutely right. I don't know what I was thinking. I must have pregnancy brain already. Are you keeping the kid? Yeah. Okay, I'm not. I didn't know what you were doing. You hadn't told me anything yet. I didn't know what your thinking was. Nothing. Because I basically have been out of loop in the last 24 hours. Well, what do you want me to do? What would you want me to do? I can't tell you what to do. I'm not telling you it's to really tell me what to do. I'm asking what you want me to do. It's not a fair thing for me to say. Well, just say it. I'm I'm tossed. I'm I'm tossed completely because you know the kid wasn't made out of love. For one thing, you don't love you don't love him. But on the second hand, it's a life. No, so I'm, I'm completely lost on them. Okay, so you've obviously been thinking about it all this time. If there was a perfect world, yeah, what would you have I, me do at this point? It's not a, if it was a perfect world or a world, but I would have wanted you to not sleep with them. <laughs> Still there? Okay. Who 
Yeah. Sorry, baby, you all right? Talk to me. I know what's tied on you, too. I mean, I really know what's tied on you. It's harder on you than it is me. I don't want it to be hard on you. Well, it is. I know. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. My dog just burped. <laughs> sorry about that. <sighs> it is really hard on me. It's not easy to... <laughs> No. No. Hello. Are you laughing or crying? I can't tell. Okay, now we can tell you're crying. Okay. I love you. Baby. Baby. I'm so sorry. It's gonna be all right. Be sorry. Are you sure about that? Are you sure? I'm more than sure. Am I sure about what? Are you sure everything's gonna be all right? Yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> Have you thought about? Have you thought about not having it? What do you mean? Not ha- like having an adoption? <laughs> what was that? That was my dog. Oh. Sorry. They're yeah. just, everyone's kind of crazy around here. Well. What have you what have you thought about? You haven't told me anything yet. I've just thought about what I'm what am I supposed to do? You know, I've thought about Am I supposed to keep this baby? Am I I can't I don't feel like I can just I don't know. I've had so many, so many thoughts and feelings, you know, there's, there's always abortion so that I don't get fat for you. Cause I know you would be upset about that. And of course my boobs would get bigger and you already told me that that's ugly. Oh, uh-huh. my boobs would get bigger and you already told me that that's ugly. Things ugly. Ain't nothing ugly about it. Ain't nothing is ugly about your boobs. I know you told me that. Boy, you're ugly. Your boobs are ugly. There's no part on you that is ugly. Stop thinking that there is, because there isn't. You I said before that. Part of you. 
You said before that you liked small boobs better because then you could pay more attention to the face. It doesn't matter. I pay, I pay attention to the, to the person. The person is what I pay attention to. I think you're beautiful anyway. Are you laughing or crying? I'm like completely I'm crying. Lost here. I'm crying. <laughs> well, it sounds like you're laughing to me. <laughs> I'm sorry. So what's funny? It's, <laughs> nothing's funny. Nothing's funny. All right. <laughs> I've had Something a couple of drinks. Funny, you're laughing. I had I had a couple of drinks. You've had a couple of drinks. Yeah. So when did that start? This morning. This. Oh, fucking good. How many drinks is a couple of drinks? I don't really know. I don't remember. Who did you have the drinks with? Um. <clears throat> Mostly myself. Who else? Nick. And? That's it. None with your, your, your ex or your husband, whatever you... He's not here. Now. He's not here. I told you where he's okay. at. Avoid me all day so you could drink. I I was really stressed out, and you were mad. I was, I was mad. I was leaving you alone so you could think. Not well, so I was drink. thinking that you were mad. You didn't tell me not to. I didn't know not to. I just wanted it I to... I told you before, you call me and text me anytime that you want. You don't need to ask. It doesn't matter if I'm mad or not. I'm always going to answer your call. I know. I'm not going to leave you hanging me if you text me. Unless I'm in a position where I really can't text. Well, think rhymes with drink, so I went with drink. Huh? Think rhymes with drink, so I went with drink this time. The same time you went to drink, you went to drink. No, think rhymes with the drink. Right? Um, uh, yeah, the I N K does. Not the D R and the T H. Well, the, right, because if, if it did, then it would be the whole, it would be the same word, and it wouldn't be a rhyme. There you go. <sighs> right. I'll explain rhyming to you when I explain it to my children. You what? Nothing. <clears throat> so did you go to work at all today? No. So why'd you tell me you were leaving the studio soon? Well, I stopped by. I didn't actually work. I always have to stop by. I have to make sure everything's okay. Tell me what you thought about I thought about how mad you were going to be and how you would feel knowing that 
my egg has another man's sperm in it, and it's making a baby. Yeah, and that's what's been bothering me. Oh, these dogs. Sorry about that. <sighs> I'm starting to sober up a little bit. Oh? I'm starting to sober up a little bit. I don't feel that well, but I can't tell if it's the baby or the alcohol. <laughs> Once you get on the abortion, then the sooner the better. So maybe, maybe don't feel anything. When does a baby start to feel something? I don't know. I've watched stuff on it on TV before, but I can't remember what you said. What if I named him Lauren? If I have a boy. Yeah, like the father would go for that. And it hey, my. wouldn't be my kid. I, I would be my kid. I wouldn't want you to do that. Oh. So you're not going to like the kid? No, the kid didn't do anything. So you're not going to like me then, because I did something. I'm going to love you. I can't. I can't blame you for anything. Cause it was before. You're something before you and I ever got together. So I can't. Uh, I can't blame you for anything. I can upset about it, but I can't blame you. I can't be mad at you about it. It'd just be wrong for me to to do that. I can't hold it against you. I'm not gonna hold it. I'm hold it against you, unless we had already met and you had cheated on me. So you want me to have an abortion then? I want you to do what what you want to do. I'm behind you on whatever you want to do. I'm just telling you that if you are going to have an abortion, then you're going to, you want to do it ASAP. Well, I just... I just, I'm worried about getting fat because then you're going to not like me anymore. Why would I not like you if you got fat? Because. Fat has nothing to do with with me loving you. I still love you even if you got fat. Another problem is I, I got to take into consideration the father's feelings. Do you have room for a nursery in your house? Oh. Uh-huh. Do you have room for a nursery in your house? Oh, no, there's room for anything I want my house. All I got to do is add on. Okay. I can make miracles work here. Guys don't like fat chicks. Huh? Guys don't like fat chicks. Guys don't like fat chicks? No. 
I did as a fat chick before. You did? Who was that? Girls. Uh, it was a very short dating thing, but... <laughs> did you know about was, it? Because uh, I met Paula right after I went on my two dates with her. So I told her. Oh, so it was a one-night so stand. Was, well, if I was... It was pretty much a one-night stand, but if I was, if I was smart, I would have stuck with her. And if I would have known what Paula was like, then... I would have stuck with her. Her name was Carrie. And she was a very nice, very nice woman. She was a very nice person. She was better than Paul. It's too bad I didn't know that back then. And I wouldn't be fucked so many, so many years. Still not Paula's fault. I thought we talked about that. I know. But it's taken years for me to realize it. Oh, wow. I was was naive to how people are. So, so you're getting, little girl. Is that what you're going to say to me? <laughs> no. You practicing? No. Just, no, she's been only a tonsil and sniffing her bowl today. Cause I have whack for her. <clears throat> she's been a, she, she'll come out here and bug me and bug me and bug me for a treat or... Or to eat. She knows when it's supper time or when it's breakfast time. And today she came out early and wanted to eat. I thought I'd feed her earlier. I'd just give them, give them both a biscuit. And, and she still wouldn't stop bugging me. Oh. So finally at 4, four o'clock my time, I said, okay, supper time. So I fed her and then she still bugged me. What the hell is going on with her? Yesterday, she didn't want to have these at all. Can I call you right back? In like two minutes? Yes, you can. I'm sorry. Okay, I'll call you back. All right, bye. Okay.